there. All right, let's bring in meteorologist Leah Pizzetti because Leah, the heat in our area today was record breaking, but it also comes at a price, right? Madison, today is truly going to be one for the books. SeaTac, like I mentioned earlier, hit 80 eight degrees. Keep in mind, normal for this time of year is 60 degrees, so we're almost 30 degrees warmer than that seasonal average. That definitely makes this the warmest October 16th on record. Previously, it was 72 degrees. Also, the latest 80 degree or warmer day in the calendar year observed so far in recorded history. Just one degree shy of the all time record for the warmest date set in October. So 88 degrees once again, extremely warm today. We continue to track how many days in the month of October have been 70 degrees or warmer. We already broke that record this last week. We continue to increase that record. We're at 11 days now so far in the month of October, 70 degrees or warmer. And it wasn't just C Tech that broke records today. Bellingham got up to 80 degrees. Olympia up to 85 degrees. Records were 70s in the 70s. Keep in mind, like I said, 60s is where we are usually for this time of year. So once again, these are our observed highs for today. Look at all those 80s on the map. It was extremely warm, hot today. Not normal for typical October. Heading into tomorrow, though, we are going to see a pretty big plummet in temperatures. So anywhere from 10 to 15 degrees of a drop into tomorrow. So you'll likely feel that cool down. We are going to see more 60s on the map. We'll still hang on to some 70s in places like Shelton, but I am expecting more 60s to pop up. Then we're going to see some major changes into the next couple of days. Wildfire smoke, that's the other big thing that we've been talking about. So into this evening, we can see because of all of these different fires, which we broke down earlier, we are seeing a lot of that smoke pushing into the region. Into tomorrow, I'm expecting some relief to head our way. So Olympic Peninsula does look to get some clearing, but look at this over the Cascades because of all of these fires. I'm thinking the smoke will still be bad over the Cascades, but the farther west you head, the better it'll be. And it does look to improve in the next couple of days because we go from record breaking heat to finally some rain. Look at this in the next seven days. We're going to be going from near 90 degrees to check that out. 50s. So look at this 69 degrees expected for tomorrow. It's going to be much cooler. Then we're going to take a little bit of a breather. We're going to level out, stay in the mid to upper 60s through the week. Then Friday, Friday evening, I'm thinking is when we're going to start to see those rain chances make a comeback. This is something we have not seen in a while, and it is looking like it's going to stick around. I'm thinking we'll get some good rain this weekend. We need this right now, especially after today's record breaking day. Chris.